Hey guys, this is Mike with MR Bros, and today I'll show you how to install uh, your PS3 controller to your computer. I decided to do this video since uh, the PS4 released, well, almost a year ago, in a couple of months. It's uh, July this uh, month, so in a couple of months. And the PS3 controller is now a lot cheaper since it's not the current gen well it's the old gen so let's get started the things you will need are a mini USB a DS3 the link will be in the description and a obviously a PS3 controller so um, the uh, site will bring you here and you want to go into download downloads uh, tab okay so then you scroll down until you see here 32 bit and 64 bit uh, and these are all the versions so you want obviously the latest version but this one is in testing so it should still work so click site one and it's gonna get you like ask you where to save it so I'll save it to my desktop press save and then open it up with a uh, like WinRAR or WinZip or 7-Zip and then you just want to double click on this uh, program right here the EXE press run press yes you didn't see that but it's like admin privileges next uh, choose your location program files is fine I guess I want to start menu yeah sure I don't want a quick launch but I do want a desktop icon install and then it says run DS3 tools so finish you can close the browser and the program will open one thing I want to mention is that you need internet uh, internet connection to run this program so if you don't have internet this program will not work okay so now the program is open uh, I'll take my PS3 controller and I'll plug it in my computer so wait two seconds It's going to connect, installing device driver software. I'll close that down. Uh, no Java, I don't want to update you. Okay, so now that it's connected, it should go into driver manager. Okay, yes, it's, it's a user account control. You don't see this, but it's DS3 tool, so press yes. And then the Dual Shock 3 6 axis USB will connect. I, what I do is I press vibration testing, and if the controller vibrates, means that it does work. So for most games, they use a Xbox 3 Xbox 360 controller. So if you want to select the mode, use this one, and it's gonna like make your PS3 controller work with. Uh, games that use the Xbox 360 controller. So, um, I'll just show you game controller panel. Oh, there's an update. So properties, as you can see, yeah, all the buttons do work. I don't know why the. Uh... Okay, wait two seconds. Uh, remind cancel so I'm gonna press enable yeah you have to do that before before uh, going on the game controller panel because it only thinks it's uh, not without joystick properties okay now yeah now they work what's the the z-axis oh, okay right there okay so as you can see everything works so yeah i hope you enjoy please leave a like comment and subscribe i will be back with a lot more and as always see you guys next video bye guys